If you can't remember your computer's admin password, this video is for you. We are going to look at how to reset it without losing any of your data. A user account password, or admin password, is the password you use to log into your Mac. It may also be used when you install software or change settings in system preferences. You created this password when your computer was first set up, and you can change or reset it using the method we're going to look at right now. The first thing we want to do is restart our computer by going to the Apple logo in the top left, clicking on that, and then clicking on Restart. As your computer is restarting, hold down the Command R key on the keyboard. Continue to do this until you see the Apple logo show up on boot. Newer Macs will have a black background and older Macs will have a gray one. In either case, they should boot up shortly into the recovery partition. Once you're booted into the recovery partition, navigate up to the menu bar and click on Utilities, and then select Terminal from that menu. Once Terminal is open, type Reset Password as all one word into the window, and then hit Return on your keyboard. This will open the Reset Password utility. Once in the Reset Password utility, click once on your hard drive, then select the user account that you'd like to reset the password for. Once you've selected your user account, enter and then re-enter your new password. And if you'd like, add a hint. When this is done, you can press the Save button. You will see a warning indicating that you will want to create a new keychain when you log back in to your user. After you've clicked OK to that warning, you can go ahead and restart the computer by clicking the Apple logo on the top left and then clicking Restart. After you restart your computer, you may be prompted with a window that asks to create new keychain or update keychain password. It is important that you select Create New Keychain if this pops up, otherwise your computer will continually ask for a password for every application that needs one, which you'll find out would be a lot if you don't do this. So click Create New Keychain, and the reset of your password is complete. Thank you guys so much for watching this video today, and please comment if you have any follow-up questions or if there's future topics you'd like to see us tackle here at Simple Solutions. Thank you so much. Make sure to click subscribe for all of our latest updates. And for an exclusive offer just to our YouTube audience, click the link below to save you over 60% off of our latest course on Udemy.